Hi, I'm Felipe, a sales engineer at Insightly, and today I'm going to be demoing a chat system that is fully integrated with Insightly via our integration tool called AppConnect. We've seen our customers leverage chat with Insightly to provide a seamless user experience and to assure that all of their teams can be empowered with the central information that Insightly provides as a platform. For example, being able to execute on company-wide service level agreements for escalated tickets, update crucial info immediately to sales teams when there's new data coming in from the support side, or providing analytical information on how the customer support workflows are performing. This unified platform enables end users to have a stronger customer service experience, leading to increased revenue from recurring sales and reduced churn by having happier customers. The chat system that I'll be showing is called Com100, but be aware that this is to show an example of a general chat tool that we could integrate. The example that I'll be showing is a website called SolarNext. It is a solar company that provides installations of solar power for the residential and commercial clients. I'll show the general process from the chat agents answering questions, what that looks like when it's brought into Insightly, and then both the processes and results that the integration will allow for your customer service workflow. On the left-hand side, I have SolarNext's website, so this would be what a customer would see. And on the right-hand side, I have what the chat agent will be seeing. Let's start by clicking this. And we have some information that's been pre-populated from an earlier chat, so I can simply start chatting. On the agent side, I'll simply accept this chat. And at this point, I, as an agent, am chatting to a customer. In this case, let's say that the customer is asking for some specific help that can't be answered directly by the agent on the chat. So in this case, we're saying that they have a large installation coming up, and this would be something that the chat agent would have to escalate to a specific team. But the chat agent identifies that, and responds accordingly, and the customer mentions that there is a high degree of urgency and it is time sensitive, so it would be something that would have to be done quickly. So the agent in this case, knowing that there's some urgency on this ticket, can specify that when they are escalating it. So let's go into this section. And note that these, all of these details are fully customizable. These are only the ones that I've created for this specific demo. I'm going to mention that there is a specific question, add a generic subject, and select a high urgency for it. I can then respond that we'll be responding in the next two hours as far as when this ticket will be responded to uh, for the customer and check in if there's anything else that we need. The customer can say that there isn't anything else. And so in this case, as a chat agent, I can simply leave the chat and go handle other ones. So to recap what we just did, we had a chat that came in, the agent identified what the requirement was and realized that they needed to escalate it to a separate team outside of the chat system. They've created a ticket, then ended the chat to continue to take other ones. So we can see that in Insightly the ticket is created and that the transcript is attached and all of the information that was sent by the agent is already being leveraged by the system. Having the chat closely tied to both the service ticketing tool and the CRM allows us to leverage existing information that we know about this customer as well as new information being brought in by the agent's interaction. You can see that the Insightly service is already leveraging this information. So for example, since we know that this is a specific client and they are at a specific organization, that they have purchased an ultimate support plan. So we can provide a set of SLAs company-wide to all of those customers. In this case, since they are a client that is tied to an organization with that ultimate support plan. On top of that, since the agent has marked the ticket as uh, urgent priority, then we can leverage that as well to a specific ticket SLA. So as you can see, we have a current countdown of the expectation of when the first response should be. So this will ensure that your customers get the exact response times that you wanna provide as a company. We can also see that we are in the queue of field services. So based on the information that we already or the information that the agent put in, we can route the appropriate ticket to the appropriate team or the specific person. So for example, we can have all questions related to a specific topic that are prioritized a defined way, or all queries of a specific product that are routed to a subject matter expert, or the group that would be best be served in answering those questions. Lastly, I also want to note that we're pulling in other information into the chat. So for example, metrics like wait time and duration. In this case, what we can do is use these metrics to compare to other channels that we're using to pull in information. And to give a quick view as to what that would look like, so this is an example dashboard as far as the metrics that we're using for the different channels that we're receiving. And we can use this to compare, uh, for example, the average duration of chat versus phone or the wait time that we have for chat versus phone, as well as we can have other metrics that we have as far as the amount of solved tickets, um, unsolved tickets, pending tickets that are on hold, or tickets that are linked to a specific product type. This was just a quick example of the capabilities that we have within our system as far as being able to get chats or other tools uh, integrated within Insightly. 
If you have any questions around how this could fit with your specific workflow, feel free to reach out to our sales team.